Hello folks. I'm the kid and I'm Dan Lee. Dan Lee, back in town for, for the holidays. Yes, indeed. So I came up to the campground to uh, hang out and uh, we decided we're going to drive around the campground one last time before they uh, move out of this, what do you call it, a popcorn stand? Yeah, <laughs> you could call for, it that. For good? Yeah, really. Yeah. I haven't been up here in quite a while. Damn lake's all dried up down here. Yeah, it's a shame. It's a shame. People uh, didn't get their their party boats out. They didn't get them out in time. There's five of them just sitting on the mud down here. Yep. We're in a so. somewhat of a drought in, in this area in North Carolina this year. And yeah. Yeah, I guess so. You don't really know it until you come and look at something like this. Yeah, I've been here six years. I've never seen a lake like this. It's really low. This, They're not going to see it either because yeah. I, I, I should have brought my other camera so I could have yeah. shut out the window. But Yeah, it's, it's a shame. We hate to see it like this. But that's what nature does. So, so you guys are trying to figure out if you're going to sell the whole shit and shebang and start over in Florida or if you're going to yeah. take the camper and, and, and take, take it to Florida. Yeah, I think... Uh, Either either way, it all shakes out the same. So, it's like we have a camper that we've lived in. We've had it for a while now, and we really like it. And, uh, or we can move on to a newer one. Prices have gone up, though. So, if, if we move on to a newer one, it's probably going to be a smaller one. Which is no big deal. I mean, uh, it's a place to eat and sleep and uh, watch TV and be comfortable and... So, as far as I'm concerned, it's all good. Yeah. I just feel like with your canopy and the deck and patio, it would be, be nice to be able to just sell the whole thing, all one yeah. chunk. But Yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's the... Uh, I guess we'll play with, it by ear. Yeah, it'd be nice to uh, do that. You, you know, it's a done deal. You don't have to, You can walk away, and it's, it's behind you. It's just something... shit out something new for somebody else and uh, we'll go do our own new uh, where we're headed the pirate guy moved didn't he he moved down here. yeah that that's him back there with all the uh, yeah that's what I thought yeah he was over against that that far uh, yeah. tr that far tree line over there I like this other spot up there better yeah yeah with all his decor there's a guy that's he's into pirate stuff he's got all kinds of pirate all kinds of flags He's got a pirate sitting in a, a lounge chair, and he uh, zip tied a, a, a beer a beer bottle in his hand, in his uh, <laughs> in his uh, bony hand. Yeah. But yeah, he was kind of back against the trees up here. Right, right. I haven't been down since we've been back. I haven't been down in here. So, yeah, it pretty much looks all the same. Christmas palm. Yeah. Yeah, it's just amazing. Boy, when the leaves start falling, oh my gosh, they start falling when they normally do. And I've been, I've worked in here for uh, about six years, and we wouldn't finish up till March. That's how long it would take. Well, there's just two of us, and there's 300 sites in here, yeah. and it's full of trees. So my gosh. So I don't, I don't ever want to hear. Anybody complain if they have to rake the lawn? <laughs> yeah, because it's actually good for your lawn. Yeah, have the leaves on it. Yeah, that's right. If you have one of those uh, mulching mowers, it's just a good idea. Spread the leaves out and just take the mulching mower and run over everything and leave it. You can't have as many leaves down there at the campground down there. No, it's a it's a whole different thing in in that part of Florida. There's, Pine. Yeah, there's pines. Uh, the needle, the red needle, um, they're they're huge pines too. But um, the live oaks, they they're not like the a regular oak tree. I mean, they they have a little leaf, and they have a lot of them, and they drop those things pretty much down in Florida, just about year round. They're always shedding some leaves. Yeah. 
and so it's they're they're just a nuisance especially for me I've got my hands full of those things but I like I like working down there it's it's kind of cool uh, you got some unique situations I mean you know the old saying in Florida where there's water there's alligators well we have water and uh, I was told that there is a, a nest in there there's a female alligator built a nest in that in that pond pond kind of area it's a pond that developed off of a creek that runs through the property yeah somehow it's situated just right and it, it turned into a, a fairly good sized body of water but uh, so when you're working you're always looking because if there's a female in there the males know she's in there so that's the thing about good old Florida you better be looking yeah you can have the alligators yep it's okay to be focused on what you're working on but you always got to take a minute to look over your back look the around squirrel's seriously not gonna move no he's going the squirrels yeah, he was standing right in the middle oh, of the road didn't oh, you see yeah. him no I, I was blinded by the sun well, he wasn't even moving <laughs> he finally ran it off and he started to make the turn oh they're no different in Florida it's just the they're just a little bit smaller squirrels and they have a little bit different color to them yeah but um yeah it's a, it's kind of cool there's a hawk that is not afraid of me it'll fly in it'll land on a on a fence post and just sit there and i'm just a few feet away i'm looking at the hawk and i'm thinking I hope my my head doesn't look like a meal for you yeah <laughs> it's like uh, i don't want a hawk coming after me I already had a wild pig run through there when I was working. I'm on the I'm on a zero turn mower, and uh, that of course that wild pig was just looking for something to eat. But the whole time uh, it was just a a little short piece away from me, and I was thinking, oh my god, I don't this this mower won't outrun that pig. Yeah, <laughs> they can get a little crazy. They are mean. Oh yeah. Yeah, they can get crazy. You know how it is. You saw them in, in uh, what, Texas, right? Yep. Yeah. Well, me, like an idiot, charged up batteries last night and didn't bring them. So I guess we're back at the uh, homestead. Yeah. So we'll uh, we'll make this a short video. Okay. All right. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Yes. I am the kid. I'm Dan Lee. And uh, we'll catch you next time. See ya. I don't know how long that battery is. Yeah, last. you were you were uh, you were right to bail out on that because <laughs> you want to end it the way we did. <laughs>